Round two. Will the die roll? Hmm. Yeah, gotta keep this. Like, we don't have a play until turn four, but... Eh, mana looks right. We've got a Planeswalker in hand. Feels correct. All right. Is there any... Another creature. Just wanted to verify it wasn't a permanent... All right, puzzle not. So we can actually Dovin Bane ban our opponent's first creature, technically here. Or we can play the Pioneer. Hmm. Options, options, options. Well, it's got a lot of energy going right now. But Dovin seems like something worth working towards. Especially since I can go Pioneer next turn, Chump Block with the 1-1 if I have to, against something. And then I can play Wisp Weaver and get another one. All the while building up Dovin. Unfortunately, his emblem is not as debilitating as you'd like. It can be pretty debilitating, though. Yeah. And it's activated abilities can't be activated. Too bad that's a triggered ability. So we can go over it again. Pioneer is an option, and I can attack for three, or Dovin is an option and start building him up. I mean, he's got bigger payoff later. I think we're going to go Dovin. Let's, let's go for the long haul here. All right. So I think my opponent's plan is make it unblockable. I see. It's not a big deal. We're just going to go with the same game plan here. So I can just weaken the Rhino... Play a Pioneer. So we'll weaken the Rhino again. Play the Pioneer. Make a Servo token and pass. Um, for some reason, it's not with the ability. That's not the ability that I thought it was, but we're still fine. So I guess if I had put all my eggs in one basket, I would have been able to block there. But that's all right. That is all right. So, let's attack with Pioneer. Play Wisp Weaver Angel. Pioneer. Do I want another servo token or do I want a 3-2? I probably want a 3-2 now. Just for that uh, gear per guide ability. Dovin's kind of already done his job. It's sucked up some damage. Um, but let's go ahead and weaken, I guess, the Rhino again. 
My opponent wants to invest mana in gear per guide. I'm okay with that. Opponent's got a lot of energy. All right. Mm, still not going to be able to kill Dovin here unless they got a fight spell. Okay, so they have a combat trick. Huh. Well, I don't think I want to play around it. Let's make them use it. So block like that, block like this, and block like this. And they're all coming at Dovin. All right. Well, that worked out fine. Very good. Very good. Ooh, look at that Sky Whale. Look at this. Dovin doesn't have to do anything. That's the beauty of... That's the beauty of Dovin. I never have to draw cards. That was a sexy draw, by the way. The Sky Whale. Flyers for days. I feel like opponents should have been bashing with that Rhino a while ago. Wouldn't it have gotten beefy by this at this point? So I can draw a card off Dovin and he still stays alive. It's pretty awesome, actually. Just force more attacks on him. Seems good. Because um, I don't think I can save him from another attack, right? I mean, I can. I just need to block. Eh, maybe it's worth it. And then I just draw pure gasoline, of course, because... I'm not a fair magic player. I am not fair sometimes, and I like it. All right, so let's get in there. Attack for a million. Play this dude. And get a dude. All right. Both coming at me. Well, we will take it. 10 damage it is. All right. Well, Dovin was cool, huh? Is his name Dovin? I hope I'm saying his name. It's kind of a weird name, I guess. Dovin. He's a weird-looking dude, too. Uh, all right, so opponent's deck. Green-red. Saw one red spell. Which is good in our opponent's deck, though. Um, didn't see a ton of energy payoff, did we? We saw the, tur the, the Rhino, rather. Uh, the module is. Yeah, the module's a good energy payoff. The artist is good. Rhino is good. Everything else is fine. Nothing amazing from what we saw. And a tune with a ether seems strange. In the, well, it gives energy. But only seems strange because it's a two-color deck. I just think of this card as more of a three-color deck card. But all right. Anything I want to do against green-red energy based on what we saw? I guess not really. 
Trade Winds is going to be worse just because bounce effects with a lot of Enter the Battlefield abilities like our opponent's got is going to be worse, but it's still certainly going to be useful. So let's have it stick around and try again. Well, I haven't had this in a while, but uh, yeah, I can't even remember the last time I played a game one and then the opponent no-showed for game two. So they disconnected and then they just never came back. All right. Well, we'll take the win and we'll move on to round three. We'll see you then.